So these are unmanned aerial camera systems. Uh, and everything is produced locally and then we ship it out to you. Yeah, you keep this religiously in the fridge. Okay. Five to seven years. Right, we're the Great Lakes dealer for the Benetil Powerboat products. Hey guys, Eric Kyle here, publisher of Great Lakes Scuttlebutt Magazine, and I'm excited to be down to the Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show right here in sunny South Florida, and I love it. This is by far the best show on the planet. As a matter of fact, while I'm here, I'm kind of wandering around, and I'm looking for some exciting and new products to report on, and I ran across our friends over at Naughty Buoy. How are you, sir? I'm very well, thank you very much. Clay, it's Thanks a pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you. This is really neat. I mean, when I was a little kid, we used to have these big wooden rafts supported by big oil drums. This is something that I have never seen before. Tell me about Naughty Boy. I'm, I'm my partner and I ex super yacht crew, and mm -hmm. uh, we were, about five years ago we were working on board a 40 meter yacht. Uh, we had a bit of time out, and suddenly overnight we came up with this concept. And it was actually originally designed as a sort of a, almost a maintenance tool. Okay. Uh, so we, we decided to go for it. We got some prototypes, and we sent them out into the industry. And what was happening is the bosses were sort of going. You're not using that for maintenance. I'm going to use that. I want to do it. Set, a, set an esky, set a cooler up on it, get, some, get a ladder up on it. So we thought, okay. So we sort of um, we outsourced some some seats here. We designed the headrest and the boarding ladder, uh -huh. and we turned it into this sort of this uh, relaxation float, effectively. Yeah. Uh, and then what we wanted to do as well was because storage space being a premium on board these yachts, we wanted to make it modular so you can make jet ski docks out of it and uh, one to do all really. We designed some covers so the guys could still use it as a maintenance float, but okay. primarily it's now used as, uh, for recreation and the tertiary use is the uh, for the maintenance side of things. Well, I love the fact that it's inflatable. It is, yeah. This is, um, we do four sizes. Mm -hmm. This one's the largest we do and this inflates in three minutes and 30 seconds to 3.6 psi and it also deflates in three minutes and 30 seconds and rolls up just like a carpet. Easy to store it. It's really easy to store, yeah. I it's love it. Made really stable underneath. We've got the um, four 10 gallon ballast bags. Yeah, um, keep it stable. Exactly, but it stops the sort of the sliding and the tipping. But when you finish, you can actually manually dump the water out. So then you're just lifting the 93 pound platform out of water. Nice. Now, I'm a big guy. Right. We go to the same gym. <laughs> we do go to the same gym. So, um, how much weight can one of these hold? This one will take about 1,500 pounds. I'm not that big. Yeah, no, exactly. No, <laughs> this, is, this is absolutely fine. We'd be good on this together. Yeah, yeah. yeah and that's, we, could, we can stand up on this and walk around, no problem. Yeah, so you could have like, you know, five, six, seven people out of one of these this, things. We're EN compliant, so this will take, we, we sort of recommend five people for this. Okay. Yeah, but I okay. mean, again, 1,500 pounds is five big people. Yeah, that's five very large people. Yeah. And the functionality of this as well, if I wanted to go, say, um, snorkeling over a particular reef, can I take a line and tie it off to a mooring? ball or something like that and just use this as my platform to snorkel uh, from? Absolutely. You've got um, on the underside, uh, you've got a nice big strong anchoring point basically. It's all soft loop. You'll notice on the sides and on the underside there's no hard parts. So this can sit alongside a boat. Okay. Uh, you can inflate it on deck. It won't do any damage. But yeah, you can certainly you could tow this out with the ballast bags up take it to your sort of designated uh, snorkeling zone and drop it off an anchor. So we have a lot of lakes up in the Great Lakes. I could take it out somewhere kind of anchor it out yep. and we can swim to it like we would a raft when I was a little kid. Perfect. I mean, that's ideal. That's, that's one of the many uses, yeah. Now, right now, a lot of people are using those roll-up foam things and it's becoming pretty popular up in the Great Lakes. Why would I want one of these rather than that? Well, firstly, this is going to keep you dry. This yeah. isn't going to sit in the water. Uh, it's just a more solid structure that you can actually walk on. Okay. It's, uh, you know what I mean? It's, uh, I keep saying to people, you can inflate real estate. Yeah. Um, it is. It's a, it's, a, it's a more solid, sort of uh, a higher like level that. luxury item. Perfect. All right, let's say, Clay, that I can't make it down to the Fort Lauderdale boat show. Yep. Shame on me because I need to be here. Where am I going to go online to find out more information about this product and, more importantly, where I can buy it? Uh, we, um, the website is www.naughtyboymarine.com mm -hmm. and currently we've got uh, Nautical Ventures in Florida, Fort Lauderdale, who are, are selling our products. They've got three stores in South Bryan's and they've also got in uh, West Palm. Okay, so if we want to find out more information about the product, we can go to naughtyboy.com. Naughtyboymarine.com. Outstanding, Clay. Thanks Great product. Cheers, You're going to have you. a lot of fun with us. Thanks. Naughtyboy.com. N-A-U-T-I-B-O-U-Y. B-U-O-Y. B-U-O-Y. Marine. Marine.com. That's where you want to go. Check out the products, the full lineup of products that they have there. Thanks so much for joining us today. You guys, we'll see you out on the water.